Hey guys, and welcome back to video number 439. Today we're going to be playing Clash Royale. I'm still alone. Haven't got divorced yet. The inevitable is coming. Child support will be paid. And today we're going to be playing Evolve Cannon Cycle with Bandit because I decided that, you know what? I like this combination of cards so much that I want to push the Evolve Cannon to its limit. I want to try and play Evolve Cannon and just defend everything and just chipping down the whole game. Except he's okay. You know what? Golem first play. We're back. Clash Royale is back! Yes! This is what I wanted to see against Copada. Look at that. Some chip damage already. It's over. And something I forgot to talk about in yesterday's video that I was meant to and then I started recording and completely forgot is uh, the Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul fight. What a... Oh my god. It was so shit. I woke up, like I'm sure a lot of people around the world did. I woke up at like, I don't know, it was like 4am. I was exhausted. I had a big day ahead of me. Woke up at 4 a.m. to watch this fight, and like, you know, I, it's, you know, they hype it up, it's like, Jake Paul, it's personal now, like, I'm gonna kill him, and then Mike Tyson's like, my kids are gonna see the man that, like, I truly am, and then you get in there, and it's just, it was so fucking ass, I just hate, you know what I hate, first of all, so many things I hate, you know, myself, but also the fight. And what I hate about the fight is that, at the end there especially, like, one thing it was just like, oh, so many things I fucking hate about it, but it was just like, Mike Tyson, everyone was like, Mike Tyson, do you want to see me fight again? Who do you want to see me fight? And the crowd goes, yeah! It's like, no, we don't. Like, I mean, at least I don't, because it's just like, if you, if he's an old man, like, I don't know, it just feels wrong. Like, I felt wrong watching the fight. All right, I'm going to go with Evolve Cannon here, because it's get fucking Bowie for days, kill the archers. It just felt wrong. Something about it felt wrong. Like, sure, I would love to see Mike Tyson fight. That's great. But not if he's just, like, just seeing him get beat up by younger dudes. Then, you know, Logan Paul gets interviewed at the end. And, you know, he's asked, like, what do you, like, would you fight Mike after Mike calls him out or whatever? And he's like, I'd fucking kill you, Mike. It's like, bro, like, why can't you just say something like, you know what? I think my brother had a shot at him and Mike Tyson's a legend. I think, I think I'll, um, you know, I, I got to respect his, I don't know, just a bit of, just a, just a bit of something. Something that was a little more respectable, but no. Couldn't be done. Couldn't be done. Had to had to gas up the potential fight, because he's going to get the bag, man. How could he... You know, everyone watching around the world, Logan Paul, it's his opportunity. I know... This is the thing. When Logan Paul is at these fights, I just know he is there. Just, like, he's he's playing the, the loving brother role now, of course, because that's the, what the internet has bullied him into doing, because he, he he's just bullied... He's, well, essentially bullied his younger brother to the point where now he has to basically be actually a quote-unquote decent brother now because otherwise everyone's going to hate him and that's the way he gets his validation in fucking his entire career even though everyone kind of does hate him anyway but like it just feels it just feels fake like when I see Logan Paul like in the in the background of Jake Paul stuff it just feels like he's trying to get into the Netflix documentary it, everything he does it just feels like he's trying to get the I don't know what it is maybe it's just me being cynical but I feel like every time I see that guy in Jake Paul's background even if he's spraying like like Jake Paul's like W deodorant it just feels like he's trying to get some cloud out of it or something I don't know why like he's always in the background frame whenever he does some like Jake does something he's always there like it's just I I I feel like he's literally just he's so, i think I, I fucking hate him i think he's just a sociopath and he literally just cares about his own success and so yeah if he has to play the role of a loving brother quote unquote to get what he wants then he'll do it that's basically how i feel about it but anyway back to the fight man i just hate like people are like oh like yeah okay mike tyson's old right he's old and he shouldn't have been doing the fight and everyone's like like, fuck Jake Paul. Like, Mike Tyson agreed to it. He wanted to do it. And when it's like, oh, I just feel bad. Like, he's there. What? He made $20 million. You know, obviously he's an old man. But, like, he agreed to it. He's making $20 million. I, I would love $20 million. That would be fantastic. You know what I mean? Like, Jake Paul made $40 million. Obviously, we know he's a bit of a scumbag. But, like, Mike Tyson made... Like, just people feeling bad. I don't know. It felt wrong watching it because he's 60 years old and it shouldn't have got, it shouldn't have fucking happened. But I just, I don't, I don't like it. Like people are like, yeah, we want to see you fight again. I don't know. I don't, if he it performs the way he did when I watched that fight where fuck, literally fucking nothing happened. No, I would not want to see that again. I don't know. It's just, it's just not entertaining. It was a boring ass fight. And I just hate how they hype it up. 
they hype it up like it's personal like he's gonna fucking die and then just nothing happens and i i remember thinking about when this fight happened it's just gonna be a fight that like goes to points and it's just gonna go that that's just literally gonna be it no one's gonna get knocked down and then I convinced myself as the promotion was going that, wait, this could actually be fucking hype. Like, Mike's, you know, he slapped him at the press conference and, like, Jake seems, like, locked in and fucking angry. But um, I think everybody just feels like they got scammed by the consensus on the internet as well because it was just... It was just... Oh, it was just annoying because it was like everybody was invested. It's funny how Netflix went down as well. Everybody was invested. And then, uh... It was just nothing. Yeah. I fucking hate it. Anyway, why is this guy playing Pekka Mini Pekka? Um, I'm just gonna go with Evolve Ice Spirit to counter this, and then I'm gonna go with a cannon to try and do some damage to the wizard, and that's perfect, because now I can just pretty much bar barrel, go with skeletons as well, so the attacker doesn't kill it. Alright, I think we should be able to attack at the same time here. Okay, I don't know how the wizard fucking survived, but rigged game. Rigged. People were saying the fight was rigged, people were saying, like, the moment, also it was weird that Mike Tyson was licking his gloves, but people were saying that the moment Jake Paul, like, got, like, fucking brutalized by, um, Mike Tyson in a combination of punches. Like, Jake Paul, like, l like licked his glove or he, like, what, like, stuck his tongue out or something. People were saying that was, like, him signaling to Mike to, like, chill out a bit. But, like, no, I don't believe that. Let's be honest. Probably not. As much as I would love to believe that. Wait, that's an Evolve Pack. Why the fuck do I play Skeleton? He's gonna freeze. This is dangerous. As long as the... Ooh, okay... This is getting a little bit scary, but it's fine, I think. I don't know how I'm going to win this, because he has Mini Pekka. I had to go... I had to go Skeletons there. Alright. Alright, we're going to go like this. And then I am going to go like this, just to do some damage to the wizard. Perfect. And then why is my... Oh, my Meg... I forgot to use the... I forgot to use the boost potion on my... On my, um... Oh, my Mega Minion, so it's under-leveled. So if I lose this game... Wait, battle's about to fucking end? Oh, wait, no, it's not. I'm in... Are you serious right now? Alright, so I'm starting to realize that my deck is actually fucking ass cheeks, and my only win condition is Bandit, and that's not good in this game. And he has Mini Pekka in hand. What the fuck? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna try and catch him right now. Okay, now he just plays Mini Pekka. <sighs> okay, how the fuck am I supposed to win this? Right, let's go like this. Alright, you know what? I'm going to build up a push in the bag. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. Hopefully that dashes onto the fucking thing. Okay. Weird. Weird plays from the Joker himself. Fuck sakes, man. Alright, let's just... If he doesn't... If I don't know what's happening, he doesn't either. That's the strat. Let's try and snipe this with a bandit. Hopefully he... Okay. Fuck sakes, what am I doing? This deck is ass cheeks. Why did I think this was a good idea? Also, funny how fucking Mike... Like, I tune on the Mike Tyson fight. Mike's asshole is, on, like, literally on Netflix. The fuck? Like, there was a... Like, his literal ass cheeks were just out. How did that happen? What, what the fuck happened with that? Maybe I just woke up and chose violence this morning. Oh, that actually... That game actually pissed me off, man. That... I'm annoyed. All right. This next game, oh, now I have to want, have to wait for the overtime thing to tick down and watch my towers dwindle all the way down. But hey, I can't be mad because at least I've met Judo Sloth. Am I right or am I right? Smash subscribe. I'm not tilted at all. You know what? I'm just going to take out Bandit and I'm going to put in fucking Mini Pekka because that, that's actually just pissed me off that much. Mini Pekka in deck, good. Evolve Cannon was great, but I had not no offense. Ice Golem and Mini Pekka has more synergy. At least Mini Pekka does some damage. I can support it with Evolve Cannon on offense. Bandit's just like, dash and does fuck all. How did I win the game before? I'm tilted. I'm slightly tilted right now. <sighs> I hate everything. I hate everyone. And, yeah, no. The, the Mike Tyson-Jake Paul fight was just a clown show. People were saying it's everything that's wrong. Well, like, this is the end of boxing. Obviously not. But, like, um, people were saying, like, this is, like, every... Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul is everything that's wrong with the world. Look, everybody... It, it's just two guys that were friends, essentially, coming together, being like, we can host a massive show and make a shit ton of money. And then... <laughs> I just hated how they, like... Okay, it was wholesome how they hugged at the end of the fight. God, I sound like such an angry little man right now. It's because I am an angry little man. Um, when they hugged at the end of the fight, I don't know, it was just like, it was almost like, yeah, okay, I'm sure the pay-per-view numbers were historic, but they're acting like we they did something actually, like, crazy historic. But really, like, 
Was it that fucking... It was just like, I don't know. It was just a 60-year-old versus a 27-year-old and a bunch of people wanted to see because Mike Tyson is literally Mike Tyson, but he's just an old man. They hugged like it was some like historic event that they did together when it was just a couple of guys like... I don't know. I just hate how they like... Jake Paul goes back to his locker room and like they're all fucking gassing him up like he's the greatest fighter of all time where he's like, we did this. We held the biggest... Like, I don't know. Just like a clown show, really. And it's just like, it was annoying because it was like, they made so much money, essentially of just like, almost like, I guess it's showmanship, but it feels like just being lied to and then like not delivering on the actual event. And they, who gives a fuck? Because if people have tuned in, they've already made their money anyway. All right, fuck this, I'm going in. That's why it annoyed me because the event sucked and they made it seem like it was great. And then in the end, they just like hugged it out as if they, because they just scammed the world essentially, which is, I guess, fair play. But, like, it's just annoying. It's just annoying because, like, we want them to be, like, rivals and, like, hate each other. That's the whole thing. But, just, I don't know, that shit pisses me off. It just pisses me off that they were, just, oh, we, like, we, we did, I don't know. I, it, it annoys me for some reason. I, does it annoy anybody else? Am I just, like, an incredibly angry mood this morning? Or did that just... Something about that hug at the end, like, I don't know. We scammed the world. We made million dollars. We did this. Everybody needs to gas us up now. We did something huge. Like, what did you even do? There was nothing done. It was just like a scam, basically. It was literally just a fucking under-delivering stupid thing that happened. Like, sure, if the fight was good, like, you're fine, but it wasn't. <laughs> so annoying, man. So annoying. Alright, please hit the barb. Oh wait, that's gonna heal. Nah, but it's okay, because I got fucking ice golem. I got an ice golem push, apparently. Right, at least cannon and mega minion is gonna be good against this. Alright. <sighs> Go for an ice golem here. Easy defense. Should be. Hey, don't trust that. I knew that was dead, but still didn't trust it. Alright, let's go with this. Please don't... It. And he's played the thing in the back. Alright. <sighs> How am I going to win this? we got a minute. Let's go with this. wonder what he's going to play here. He's going to play a fisherman. Right, okay. Sure thing, bud. Alright, well I'm going to take this value with the, the missiles. It's just damage, really. At the end of the day. Okay. Where did my... Where did my evolved ice spirit go? That was meant to clutch up. Okay. Easy peasy, right? Come on, give me some fucking damage here. Come on. Oh, he pulled it. I thought the fisherman might have just gone for it. How does he seem to just always have evolved cards? Alright, Mega Minion's going crazy right now. Alright, let's go with this. You know, this will be fun to defend. Let's go, baby. Fuck's sakes, got my, uh, got my evolved spirit. Don't. Go, Mega Minion! Die, you little fuck! I'm not gonna lie, I'm extremely tilted today. I just wanna, ah! I just wanna, uh, I just wanna fight. I just wanna fight an elderly man in the ring right now and rip his, rip his heart out. Carve his skin off and wear it! Smash subscribe.